Hey guys, go, what's going on? Odima here, and uh, I'm gonna be bringing you another a an, uh, another kill confirm match. Um, I think from the same session with my same subscriber. Uh, this time that we were on the same team, and uh, this was on the map Resistance, which is probably my favorite map in the game. I've made up my mind that it's just my favorite map. It's really looks really nice, very colorful, colorful, very you know it's typical Paris, I guess you could say. I mean, I've been to Paris, so I know what it looks like, and it looks very similar to Paris. And it looks very nice, very clean, um, and it's a very good. It's a very good layout. Definitely my favorite mat. Uh, so in this match, I was using the think the PP ninety M one, which is probably my second favorite gun or third favorite gun. The first gun is probably the P ninety. Second is the FMG nine. Third gun is this. Um, I think I'm running. Let me think. Uh, Sleight of Hand Pro, Hardline Pro, uh, Steady Aim, and uh, the attachments I'm using. Well, the profici proficiency is Kick. I'm re using a Red Dot Sight, and the camo is Classic. Um, and FMG9, I think, with extended mags, maybe, maybe not, is my secondary. But this is another Kill Confirm match on, as I said, my favorite map. Um, and. They're both really good guns. FMG9, yep, FMG9 with extended mags, Beast Gun also, and PP90 are very good complements. They're very similar guns, high rate of fire. PP90 is definitely better accuracy, uh, but I think the FMG9 uh, has better power to fire rate, uh, you know, that kind of ratio. I think that goes the uh, FMG9 up close. I think it's just a little more deadly uh, than the PP90 M1, but the M1 has a uh, bigger range, more easy to can handle and stuff. But, um, yeah, guys, so I learned yesterday through, was it yesterday or two days ago? I can't remember. I think it was last night. Yeah, last night. It's Friday night. Friday night, I learned via Icon Boy that um, we're getting a patch. Yes, we are getting a patch for Modern Warfare 3, uh, which is awesome. Um, and, oh, this is pretty nice right here. Yeah, that nice double kill with the grenade. I, I learned that trick uh, back in Modern Warfare 2 where... Um, one of my friends, we were playing over on, on, we were playing split screen, and one of my friends was a noob at the game, and he had this, the thing, uh, the uh, riot shield up, and one of my other friends was falling right behind him. He's like, "All right, you go first. So I just chucked a grenade at the riot shield, and they just both blew up. So that's kind of how I learned to do it from there. Uh, I always thought riot shields would just protect you from uh, pretty much explosives and stuff, but I guess not. Uh, but as I was saying, guys, I learned. Uh, through Icon Boy last night that um, uh, there's a patch coming for Mono Warfare 3, and hopefully what it, sh what it should be doing is it should be patching the lag shooting, which is awesome. We should be getting a fix to the lag shooting, so that way it'll probably have good hit detection, uh, as good as hopefully as good as Black Ops did, and um, also they're going to be fixing the issue that I know some of you have had. Um, problems with your pr uh, uh, profiles and stuff of it being corrupted. Uh, hey, even um, my profile um, got corrupted. I was at level 14 and my profile got corrupted. And I'm now at level 40, I think, uh, at this stage. Not in this game, but uh, at this stage, I'm at level 40. Um, but I was at level 14 before I got corrupted. So I know where you're coming from. It happened to me, too unfortunately but hopefully that patch will be fixing fixing the lag shooting and the uh what was I just gonna say the profile corruption stuff so guys um i got a nice clip that i just posted before this video of a beast p90 spray uh if you haven't seen it already it's a beast clip you should definitely check that out it was so i literally i i was in arcaden i think arcaden i think that's the name of the uh, the mall map, you know what I'm talking about. So I ran up the stairs near the a uh, Adom flag, and there were four guys right there, and I just let it fly with the P90. I just unloaded on them, and uh, I think I killed all four. I think I got yeah, I got a four-man spray um, on those four guys, and it was sick. I was like, yes, sweet four-man spray. This is going on YouTube. So um, I'll probably submit that to Sa X Savage's top five plays. Uh, because not only is it a beast clip, but he's apparently at a severe lack of submissions for top five plays. So I'll definitely be sending it into him. And wow, how did I not see that guy? 
<laughs> that's kind of embarrassing. But uh, yeah, so I'll be submitting that clip. But you know, before I do that, definitely check it out. It's a beast clip. Really check it out. It's sick. Um, but yeah, guys, I got uh, some more gameplays coming up. Hopefully, I'll be posting like one or two more this weekend. Uh, definitely one more. I think I have another one on Hard Hat. Um, that'll be coming probably tomorrow morning or so. Uh, that's probably like the new Nuketown Hard Hat. That's probably the second, my second favorite map. You know that construction map? It's essentially the new Nuketown slash the new Rust. Uh, if you haven't played Modern Warfare 2, which if you're on the Wii exclusively, then you haven't. Um, Rust was essentially the Nuketown. It was the really small map. Um, just like Nuketown was the Nuketown, pretty much. I mean, pretty much now the, uh, the the saying is it's not a it's not a new Rust, it's a new Nuketown because Nuketown is the ideal small map, pretty much. So this is the uh, Nuketown from Modern Warfare 3 Hard Hat, and a very small, very action-packed, and uh, yeah, it was really it's a lot of fun that map. Uh, I just uh, it's kind of a little small for my liking, but it's still very fun all the same. Uh, and that'll be coming up next, also with this gun as well. Um, and then I started using the uh, PKP, I think, uh, light machine gun and stuff. That's my pretty much my support class. I think I have two support classes, three support classes, sorry, and two assault classes. I have an assault class with an M4, an assault class with this, which is the class I'm using. And then I have another uh, support class with this, this gun. Uh, actually, no, sorry, I have... No, wait a minute. I have three... No, sorry, I have three assault classes. No. No, wait a minute. I have three... Yeah, I have... I have th no, I have two... Wait, I can't even remember. I have a... No, sorry, I got rid of the M4. I have a PKP support class. Then I have a P90 assault class. I have a PP90 M1 assault class. Then I have a PP90 M1 support class. And then I have a L8 uh, 118A sniping class that supports. So I have two supports and three assaults. Right? Yeah. One, two. No, sorry. Three supports and two assaults. Wow, major brain fail right there. I don't know what just happened. Yeah, three supports and two assaults. Uh, but I mostly run assaults because I think those are just, you know, the more traditional kill streaks. So that's what I like to run more. Uh, pretty much, I think, my PP90M1 uh, uh, support class and PKP assault uh, support class both have Spy Plane, Sam Turret, and Escort Airdrop. And my sniping class has Spy Plane, Counter Spy Plane, and Sam Turret, I think? Something like that. Yeah, Sam Tart. Um, so, yeah, guys. Uh, if you haven't seen it already, I put up my uh, friend code for Modern Warfare 3. It's up on my channel. Uh, it's a couple of videos before this one. Uh, so, if you want to add me up on Modern Warfare 3, please go ahead. I've got, like, uh, I think 10 people or so that have added me so far, uh, which is great. Uh, love playing with you guys. It's a lot of fun. But, uh... Uh, commentary is about ending soon, or the video is going to end soon. So yeah, check out that Beast Spray. Add me up on Modern Warfare 3 if you want, or Black Ops and Modern Warfare Reflex. My Black Ops and Modern Warfare Reflex codes are on my channel. I'll have to add my uh, Modern Warfare 3 one there as well. So uh, thanks for watching this commentary, guys. And uh, look out for another commentary, maybe tomorrow morning or tomorrow afternoon or something like that. So yeah, guys, have a nice day. Stay chill. And I'll talk to you guys uh, later, hopefully with some more info on the uh, the patch when I get it. All right, bye.